Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Elise here at Plan With Elise and today we are planning with a new sticker book. This is the new Modern Month sticker book in mini and I'm going to use it in a classic and we're going to talk about that. Um, and I'm planning in my dashboard happy planner for the week of March 13th through 19th. I'm looking for there we go. I have two sets of tweezers. One is really old and like, I don't know, these are better. So I just couldn't, couldn't find them. Okay. So this is the planner that I use for all things plan with Elise related. So this is, um, brand releases and YouTube and Patreon and Etsy and Instagram and TikTok. <laughs> I'm tired just talking about it, but this is all the things. So the sticker book, like I said, is sized for a mini, but oftentimes you can really use any size sticker book in any planner. So that's what we are going to do today, and I will show you. All right, how about this? It's okay to not do it all. I feel like that's one of the things that I need a reminder of because I'm not great at slowing down. It's not something that I do very well. It's something that I would definitely like to get better at. And I'm working on it, right? There's different times that, um, like different times that it might be more doable versus like right now where I'm coming back from being away and there's a lot of, I don't know where to put this. Hold on. There's a lot of releases happening and a lot of videos to film to share all the things. So this is definitely going to be a little bit of a busier season, but hopefully in the next couple of weeks, things will slow down a little bit because trying to do all of this while working a full-time job and spending time with my family and friends um, is, not always, is not always the easiest. That said, I love it. You know, this time that I am sitting down here, I'm trying to find something for this little space over here. Maybe we can shift you over, clear sticker. This time that I am sitting down here to film a video is like probably one of the things I enjoy most in terms of content creation. So it's worth it. I feel like I said that hesitantly. I, It's worth it. I believe that it's worth it. All right, we're gonna cover this up just in case I don't find anything else to put here. Well, that's not helpful. Why are you empty? Okay, we have a backup. <laughs> this is using a um, Papermate Dryline Ultra correction tape. Okay, it's okay to not do it all. There's my reminder. I just have to look at that every day. Now, we are going to look for some boxes or circles or something. So I'm trying to decide, do I go black and gray? Do I bring in a little bit more of the brown? These circle stickers might be good. I want, what I'm looking for are something where I have four boxes. So this is really ideal. Let's see. I think we're going to go for, can I combine the black and the gray? Like I kind of want to. Not the gray, the black and the brown. I feel like typically I would always do black and gray and I want to go a little bit different from what I would normally do. So that's what we're going to do here is we're going to need to fit both of these here. So I'm going to size this. I'm going to be deliberate about my sizing and spacing, not sizing, spacing. And then we'll take this one, put it over here. And these are where I will write my growth and progress on different platforms. So I'll usually do one for Patreon, one for Etsy, YouTube, um, and TikTok to note where I started the week at with like followers, subscribers, patrons, etc., cetera, and um, how the week continued. So I'm thinking maybe we'll bring in a strip here. I don't know. I feel like with the way this strip is, you might not really see the design. I don't know if it's necessary. We could do it vertically. There's a lot going on here. There's a lot of options. That's kind of different. Why not? Just because I've never put one vertically like that before doesn't mean we can't start now. Now, when it comes to my dashboard, the thing that's most function, the most important to me is that it's functional because like I said, I have a lot, you know what? I want to switch things up for a second. 
I have a lot of different things that I need to keep track of in this planner. So function over decoration is key to me, key for me. Okay, so we're gonna put this down here. Then I'm gonna move this one. We're gonna move the black over here. We're gonna take this one and put it here. We're, at, we're a little bit crooked because of the switcheroo I did. We'll trim that. And then this one, whoops, we'll go here. I feel like that's kind of a cool look. I don't know, it might not work. But you know what? We don't, we don't get out of our comfort zone by doing the same thing over and over again. So I feel like this works. The only thing that's bugging me is that this isn't really cut straight. So I'm gonna try to trim it straight up. Nope, that's not gonna be cut straight either. Okay, let's try something else. So instead, we're gonna lift this up. The sticker is probably gonna go in the sticker graveyard. <laughs> and now we'll take the black again. Let's put this down. I'm going to grab a washi cutter. Now this these stickers aren't washi, so they don't snap as easily, but because they're pretty thin, you can kind of get it. It's a little messy. Next time I would probably use a roller. Okay, let's try to trim off that excess. It's a little better. It's not perfect, neither am I, so we are gonna deal with it. Okay, I'm gonna deal with it, I'm not telling you to. Now, I think we could also bring in a nice, like a brown strip up at the top here. Let's get this kind of towards the bottom. And then this time, because I already have the line to go off of, we are just gonna slice it straight down for a closer, a closer cut. Okay, now I'm also going to bring in Colorful Boxes. This is a Colorful Boxes mega book because I know it has some of the small header boxes that I want. So I'm um, looking for, Originally, I was looking for just black, but I see one black here. Oh, there's a couple. Okay, perfect. So we'll put one right up here, and this will be for my YouTube schedule for the week. Then we're going to find that correction tape. This is the one that still has correction tape in it. And because we had the black up there, we're going to skip this one, put the black here. And then one more is going to go right over here. Now I am going to go for my smaller boxes. I think we'll use this color. Yeah, that's really close. It's not perfect, but it's really close. And then I need one more, this one. And this is where I'll categorize um, Etsy, Patreon, YouTube videos to film, reels and TikToks to create, etc. So I am going to split this section here, which is long. We're going to separate it so that I have four quadrants, I guess. Okay, let's move this over and get into this part. So I do want to bring in some more of these little squiggle things because they're fun. I feel like we have a lot of function in here, not a lot of deco, but that's sort of you know, my, not focus, but that's where, how I need this planner to be. Um, and then maybe we can like bring in another one. I'm trying to, I don't really need this 2023 here. So this is a good place to add in a corner sticker, but I need to move it because I can't reach all the way across to see. Short arms problems. Okay, so just a couple of these around. We're probably gonna put another one over here. And then there are some boxes I want. So, um, oh, we use those. I was like, why? There's an extra page of them. There, there were certain like shaped boxes I was looking for, these. Okay, so 
we're going to take this today sticker and it's a little it's actually a little bigger than what I want over here see even as a mini it's a little bit bigger than um, the, the function I need in this page so we're going to take this the best sticker and this is going to be for release which is when these stickers release I don't know if I mentioned that and then um, let's go back to the black um, trying to figure this out. So in terms of things I need to put down, I actually, it's going to be a busy week. I have Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. So I think we'll maybe layer these two and then kind of do a similar thing. So I'm going to take a today from the brown and then a black circle. I feel like I'm very much going out of my comfort zone with, I don't want meeting, with mixing the black and brown, but I like it. The brown is like a craft paper type of brown and it's exciting me because it's something different. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna sort of do this same layering, but hmm, I think it's gonna go Let's see like this because I do need them both for Tuesday and then because we have this brown on brown here I'm going to try to separate it a little bit so these will both be for Tuesday we have the preview which is when everything from spring release will go on the website and it's the perfect time for you to make your wish lists and everything like that and then I also have a patreon zoom so that sticker I thought was going to go in the sticker graveyard instead is just going to hang out right over here and it kind of separates the, the brown from the brown a little bit. It's kind of a nice, a nice way to separate it. I really don't like these. I thought I could live with them. I don't like them. So they are, they're not going to stay. Whoops. Well, that one might just say, Elise, I want to stay. And I know I have undo. I just don't know where it is. Oh, is it over there? No, I don't know where it is. I need to finish cleaning my office and then maybe we will we will find it I will I will find it okay so those are going to stay where they are now we need more function so I'm trying to decide I know this sticker book has bullets like and checklists but these are going to be small well they might actually fit nicely hmm okay I think they're gonna go here but there are also no I don't know I can't make up my mind I'm usually pretty decisive. Let's see. These. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna, this is gonna be a math thing. So there's three across. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten down. So there's 30. Two, three, four, five, six times seven is 42. So I really need 42. And between the two colors I'm using, we have. 60 stickers so it is enough i do think i'm going to go for these small checklists though i think that that will work if it's still crooked i can't get this one down straight i'm trying to line it up right on the line so that there's like no possible way it's crooked and somehow it still is is third time the charm okay that works third time is the charm for my lucky numbers three and we're going to, there we go, find these. And this I'm gonna shift over a little bit just because oh, we're gonna run out of some space here. Okay, now, hmm, I don't, I messed that up. So I don't wanna go across the same color, but I think we're just going to have to. And then I can do the black down here. So again, this is a sticker book sized for a mini. I don't know if this sticker book comes in classic size. Um, I hope it does. I'll probably pick it up if it does. But this is just sort of showing how you can really use any size sticker book and any size planner. And we've got two more. And let's get the black, which is gonna need probably a little bit of trimming or we can just kind of leave it 
knowing that I'm not going to get through the bottom there. Okay, this side is finished, I think. Let's go back here because we've got a lot of empty space. I feel like this is always how I do my dashboard spreads is I get to the right and then I'm like, okay, now the left is looking pretty blank. So let's bring, maybe we can like bring this in right over here. And then what if, I don't know if this will work, but we're gonna try it. That's crooked. We're gonna leave it. I think this should connect. I don't know what in what world I'm trying to get lines to connect with each other, but we're gonna stand up, focus. I don't think it's gonna work. But I also feel, I don't like how I put it because now it's just like a corner sitting there. So maybe we'll put this here and I'll punch it. And then I think that will, will this work? We're gonna try to do some lifting. It might work because I did already lift these. Once you lift a sticker successfully, it becomes a little bit easier to lift it again. So I'm layering this so that I'm not really taking up too much space, but it's still kind of there. So just sort of little random elements of these abstract designs. And then we're gonna take my We Are Memory Keepers punch and punch through right there. Okay, I'm still feeling a little empty. <laughs> I'm feeling empty. No, I'm not feeling empty. I'm feeling like this is a little empty. Um, so we're gonna bring in a quote. Your potential is endless. And let's see where the best way to put this might, best place to put this might be. Maybe right here, should fit just about. No, it's not gonna fit. Okay, move this over a little so I know it fits on the right side. And then we are going to take a white pen, flip this over, oops, and just do a little bit of coloring. We'll let that dry so the sticker doesn't move the ink. Just tap it down, your potential is endless. And then I think we're gonna do work hard and be kind. Cause that's really important to me is kindness and working hard, they're both important. Okay, I think we might be finished. It's, a, it's sort of a different kind of spread, but still very me and I like it, I'm excited about it. I feel like I don't typically go outside of my comfort zone with the dashboard, but because um, there's not a ton of room to go outside the, my comfort zone based on how I use this planner. But I think this is a good result and looking at it, I know it's still going to be functional for me. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Remember release is on Thursday, March 16th. And um, my affiliate link is in the description. If you're shopping, let me know your thoughts. Thanks again. And I will see you next time.